Hi guys, this is a Bitewiser.com Inkscape quick tip. I'm going to show you a situation where when you have some objects, you group them together and move them around the screen and ungroup them, shapes can all of a sudden, when you ungroup them, move to various places on the screen and you probably don't want that. So I'm going to show you how to avoid this. So let's get started here. I'm going to go and grab this circle tool or ellipse tool. I'm going to draw this shape here and I'll do an object to path on that. And now say I want to duplicate this. So I'll do a control D and I'll change it to another color and move it to the back by pressing end. And I want to make it look like there's an orange trim line going around this blue oval here. So what I'll do is perform a dynamic offset here and we'll just move this out kind of like this and say okay let's group everything and I want it to move over here and do something like that and I'm happy with that now and now I want to go edit these shapes again so I want to ungroup them next thing you know this orange shape here moved right back to where it was right before we moved it so let's look at what what happened here we have a shape here that is a dynamic offset and apparently what happens is when you group stuff and one of the shapes is a well any of the shapes that are dynamic offsets they will move back to exactly where they were before they got grouped which you probably do not want so what I would suggest you do and what you'll probably want to do would be to go in here and let's ungroup this guy and what you want to do is go and make this guy here that has a dynamic offset applied to him just go up to object to path and perform that now we can just group everything move whoop, and I didn't group them because I didn't select everything okay so group everything control G and move this back over here now say I want to go and edit these guys individually again I can do a control shift G to ungroup and there you go your shape stays so just make sure that when you go ahead and you move your shapes that any dynamic offsets that have been applied to them you want to get rid of that so you always want to go in and do a path object to path right here otherwise you're gonna have problems so I hope this helps and thanks for watching see you next time